Hello my soccer universe. Don't we all love unpacking videos? This is an absolutely huge parcel and it sets me up perfectly for the World Cup. It's not the last jerseys that I will get for the World Cup, I guess, but I am not sure whether this will be the last unpacking videos that I will release before the World Cup, but you know, let's see how it will turn out. Backstory first. Um, you know that one of my biggest collection goals was to have a jersey for each team at this year's World Cup. And before I open these jerseys, there are only three teams missing. Um, and thanks to, in big thanks to Idris for actually helping me get there. I mean, yes, I found two, I found uh, an Iran, I found a Japan jersey. A more a more or less on my own but he helped me big time with this awesome Mexico jersey that you've seen in a packing video which is from a 2002 World World Cup which I really like it's a little bit uh, left field Mexico jer uh, jersey and most importantly with this Canada jersey from 2006 uh, which it is not easy to find Canada jerseys I actually think of all the teams that I have um, that uh, uh, that are, are at the World Cup. Canada is right up there with being among the most complicated to find a jersey for. Uh, which leaves me with only three. Costa Rica, which is a challenge if you want to go find it on the budget. Saudi Arabia, also not the easiest one, uh, although readily available, I think, on classic football pushers, but I was a little bit nitpicky uh, what Saudi Arabia jersey I want to have. And of course, the whole Qatar, which also relatively complicated. However, with a new Nike wave coming, I was imagining that, you know, uh, it might not be that hard uh, to get. And suffice to say, this package containing five jerseys completes the 32 plus adds two valuable, uh, very valuable um, alternates that I just needed to have in my collection for a long time. Now, uh, how did I get to this dress? You know, I actually, I texted with Idris, um, I think it was towards the end of uh, September or within September and I said you know uh, in a way I have almost given up yes there are only three teams missing but I've almost given up on that because um, it is so hard to find these three missing teams at a reasonable price I'm um, anyway going over budget blah 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 then he basically encouraged me now nah, go go and see and um, in the in the end then um, I went for uh, I saw on uh, a webpage, he says, your football shirt. Uh, I think it's a French-based website. I saw one of the two teams, and that's the first one I want to take out of. Then we'll talk about the second one. Uh, but he basically encouraged me to go, and what really turned me off is that um, uh, that the shipping was so, uh, so uh, expensive because the price was all right, because for that particular team, that's the first one we're gonna take out, for, uh, that particular team, I already had seen uh, here in Austria, but it posted twice and then and never reposted. So I was kind of a little bit discouraged by that, but I saw it for the exact right price. And that's where it reset, well, have it cheap to me, it is cheaper and we'll make an entire parcel out of it, which would make it, uh, which, which, which will make the shipping the more cost effective. So, Huge thanks for Idris for helping me out already for that. But you know, let's go through it. Uh, it's of course all the way down, but I wanna get this one definitely out first. So first one out, it is. I'm wearing Canada 2006. It's another 2006 jersey. It is the Saudi Arabia home jersey from that particular World Cup. I actually gotta say now, uh, <laughs> I'm a little bit surprised because the material is actually a normal uh, soccer jersey material whereas all the 2006 jerseys that I have so far are a little bit more of the paper-like materials. But you know, so be it, it, it might be that it's just a basic version of this. Now, um, I agree, the crest, it's not, the, the new crest is better, um, but at least there's some with the palm tree in there. 
the reason why I went there for this one is because I actually saw saw the River Plate Spain in exactly this jersey. So uh, for that reason, I said, okay, let this be my Saudi Arabia shirt. I wanted to, in a way, at first I thought it, I wanted a green one or something a little bit more interesting. But I think for Saudi Arabia jersey, it's nice. It's, it has something special that, you know, I'm fine. Saudi Arabia adding to the collection of countries that <laughs> one is, <laughs> you know, that have some uh, troubles <laughs> um, or that are not very palatable in, in a way. But, you know, I actually remember very fondly Saudi Arabia at the 94 World Cup. Then he asked me, what are other uh, countries that, 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 that are missing? I said Costa Rica. And it was really hard, and I saw on vintage football area, or no, also on your football shirt, I saw a Costa Rica shirt, but it turned, turned, turned out, uh, while they sell legit stuff, but it seemed to be a very basic shirt that didn't really work out. So he went on a vintage search, and he pulled out of another Costa Rica jersey, uh, and one that I actually like, because with Costa Rica jerseys, I have to say, I was always very, very, very uh, picky, because there are some that are nice. I want to have, you know, not just a play, either it has to be a uh, uh, um, visually appealing jersey, or um, it needs to have something special in a way. And so, yeah, he pulled this. He said, it's an L. Uh, but it seems to be in really good condition. It was a really nice price on Vinted. And I was thinking, because Homa, it might not work out. But in the end, I decided, okay, I need Costa Rica. I will probably not wear too many Costa Rica jerseys. So let's go for it. And it is also the 2006 Costa Rica home jersey. Yeah, it might be tight but it's in prime condition as he promised and uh that's the one thing that all of these jerseys are in really really good condition i this might be one of the first jerseys with a brush stroke effect across so i really like that one it was of course worn in the opener of that particular world cup it is actually quite stretchy which is something that i like and i am very pleased to have a costa rica jersey it's only my fourth ever concacaf team that I have in my collection. I really like the little Costa Rican flag in there. So with that, yes, it might be a little bit tight, but I have to say I'm very, very, very pleased. So that's the first part of the video. First off, thank you so much, Idris, for actually helping me uh, with my uh, goal for the season, encouraging me to continue and for helping me with this Saudi Arabia shirt that, uh, you know, that I have shipped to you. I am very pleased with that. And of course, uh, finding this Costa Rica jersey. But I can tell you in the other two parts, uh, especially in part three, he helped me out even more with that. Oh, will it be part two? Let's see how I will post it. Okay, I will see you in the next video with the big helping hand from Idris. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!